Hello guys, in today's video we are going to find LCM which is the least common multiple and GCF which is greatest common factor faster. There are a lot of different ways to find them but the method I learned during my school year I think that's faster than any of those because I tried all of them. So let's see how we can do or how we can find LCM and GCF faster. So I wrote some numbers over here. Let's work on first these two numbers. So we're going to find LCM and GCF are both of these numbers. So what we're going to do, we're going to write these number like this. Going to make it look like something like this. So I'm going to start with the number that goes to both of them. Both are even, so 2 will work. So 2... Uh, times 21 is 42 and 2 times 18 is 36 and now I think 3 will work because 3 times 7 is 21 and 3 times 6 is 18 and then next there is no common factor these two numbers have so we're gonna stop it over here if we are looking for GCF let's say so GCF greatest common factor for these two number is going to be product of these two numbers which is 2 and 3 so 2 times 3 is 6 and now for LCM we're gonna keep going so let's do 7 times 1 is 7 7 doesn't go to 6 so we're gonna we, what we're gonna do we're gonna just write 6 as it is over here now we're gonna use 6 leave one as it is and six goes to one two six you see all one in the bottom and so lcm is product of all these numbers up to here okay so two times three times seven times six which is basically two times three is six six times seven forty two times six is uh, 252 so that is LCM again one more time so I'm gonna write the number over here I'm gonna find a number that goes to both of them so like 2 because both are even so 2 will work 2 times 21 is 42 2 times 18 is 36 then these two number 3 yes 3 times 7 21 3 times 6 is 18 now there is no common factor both of these numbers have if we stop here and multiply just those two number gives me greatest common factor and if we keep going and whatever the number left over here product of those number will give me least common multiple let's do one more in this case we are gonna, gonna use three numbers gonna write it down Again, 42, 36, 28. And it's not a minus sign. We are not subtracting. Don't be confused like if it's a minus. Okay. All are even. Start with 2. 21. 2 times 18 is 36. 2 times 14 is 28. Next. Okay. So if we look over here odd number these are to even and I don't think there is any common factor they have so in this case GCF is greatest common factor is going to be just 2 and if we keep going and then what will be we can use I believe let's try 2 again so it doesn't go to 21 so we're gonna leave 21 as it is 2 times 9 is 18, 2 times 7 is 14, now we can go to 3, 3 times 7 21, 3 times 3 is 9, 7 as it is, so there are two seven. so I'm going to try 7 times 1 is 7, leave 3 at it is, 7 times 1 is 1, then next we're going to go to 3, 1, 1 and 1. So now least common multiple is just product of these numbers which is 2 times 2 times 3 times 7 times 3 so 2 times 
2 times 3 times 7 times 3 which is again going to be I think 252 otherwise if you use the other method that's where you need to find the multiples of 42 you're gonna write them then you're gonna find the multiples of 36 then the multiples of 28 then you're gonna find which one is the least common in all of them which is like a lot of work you have to write the multiplication of 42 by 1 42 by 2 and keep going until you find a common number but in this case you don't have to do that and it's much faster than that number uh, the, the other method okay let's try these three numbers I'm going a little slow because I want you guys to see what I'm doing here so that you can learn it so let's try these three numbers which is 35 36 27 and order does not matter you can write them the way you want you know 27 here or there doesn't matter so let's do it again so what we can do I don't think any of these numbers have any common factor 35 26 27 so their GCF is basically 1 okay now we're gonna find least common multiple so let's try 3 3 goes to 12 36 and 9 27 so 3 so as I said if it doesn't go to that number leave that number as it is then 3 times 12 is 36 3 times 9 is 27 and again I think we can go to 3 I'll leave 35 as it is and 3 times 4 is 12 3 times 3 is 9 okay that's it we can go one more step like 2 35 2 and gonna leave 3 at it is okay or you can keep going let's say 2 left with 35 1 and 3 if I go to 3 gonna leave 35 1 and 1 and do one more which is 35 1 1 and 1 so LCM in this case is we should have stopped right over here too but I just want to show you the whole process you know so 3 times 3 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 35 and when we multiply all of them gives me 3780 again so this is much faster than you writing multiple multiples of these number which takes like a lot of time because all the time goes to just multiplying them with 35 times 1, 30 times 1, 35 times 2, 35 times 3, then you're gonna write for 36, then you're gonna write for 27, and then you're gonna uh, find which one is the least common in all of them. Okay, so you see, you can find both GCF and LCM just using one technique, and it's much quicker than any other method. I hope you guys like it. If yes, share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel. Any question, let me know and I'll answer your question. Thank you. Have a good day.